Hello, my name is Steve Jessup. I'm a disability attorney with Dell and Schaefer. I want to briefly discuss a case I recently took on uh, for an administrative appeal with principal. My client was originally approved for two years under the mental nervous condition limitation within the policy. Uh, during the course of that time, he did suffer a head injury that resulted in him being hospitalized in the ER for several days. Uh, resulting in post-concussion syndrome and there was indication in neuropsychological examination that there were some cognitive difficulties that may be related back to the head injury. Uh, he made principal aware of all these findings prior to the end of the two-year period. However, principal felt that everything was tied in and any deficits he may be having were due strictly to the mental health condition. This is convenient as they could then cut the benefit off at two years. So currently we're in the process of appealing this decision and trying to refute what their neuropsychological exam had to say um, as to the basis of it and prove what they say is not able to be proved that, this is, that his disability is based on an organic brain disease or condition. Uh, many policies, principal included, uh, are written in a way that the mental health limitation isn't only for a diagnos diagnosable condition under the DSM-4 or the soon-to-be DSM-5, um, but anything that may be contributed to, contributed by or caused by a mental health condition. So if they have the ability to argue and say that, uh, okay, we do think that there's uh, deficits with respect to the brain injury, but we think that's also caused and contributed by the mental health condition, it may very well limit the policy duration to two years. Um, once we have any more information on the outcome of it, we'll be sure to share it with you. Uh, if you do have a claim with principal, especially one under a mental nervous condition limitation, and you feel that there are physical conditions that are disabling you, please feel free to give us a call. We'll be more than happy to take a look at your claim and determine how we may be able to assist you.